Hi viewers, welcome to Ganesh's YouTube channel. In this tutorial, I am going to explain you how to create this type of single part drawing in Tecla structures. Okay, let's start. Open Tecla structures with US environment. Now I'm going to create column. So click on steel and select this column and click on here to place the column. Right click on mouse interrupt. Now I'm going to edit this column. So double click on it. Let's take bottom level 0. Then click on modify and close it. Now I'm going to create base plate at the bottom of this column so go to application components by using the shortcut control f in such part type number component 1042 you will get this component base plate 1042 select this component and pick the main part as a column and pick the position at the data intersection point now close this window right click on mouse interrupt click on space right click on mouse still drawing you can see now I have base plate like this okay now I'm going to create base plate single part drawing so you need to click on this option select object in component and click on this base plate right click on mouse create drawing and single part drawing you need to click on this number all modified objects then click on perform numbering you can see one drawing created successfully now click on space right click on mouse to review now go to drawing list by using the shortcut control l now you can see now I have base plate bp1 mark under type w w indicates the single part drawing now I'm going to open this drawing so double click on it now click on here to close this window you can see now I have by default base plate drawing like this single part drawing these dimensions are more than enough you can adjust these dimensions and place it or you, if you want to create new dimensions then select and delete these dimensions I'm going to increase the scale up you can see now drawing sheet we have like this now this drawing is very small so double click on this boundary you can see now I have scale 1 by 12 let's take 1 by 6 now click on modify apply ok you can see now I have drawing like this now click on this boundary and use the left mouse key to adjust the position like this now place it exactly at the middle of this drawing now I'm going to create a dimension so click on this dimension and select this horizontal dimension and pick the first point here and pick the second point next point here and click on next point here and press the scroll middle button to place the dimension like this I want to create total dimension so pick the first point here and pick the next point here and press the scroll middle button to place the dimension right click mouse interrupt if you want to adjust the position then select this dimension use the left mouse key to adjust the position drag and place it like this similar we're going to create vertical dimension so select this vertical distance and pick the first point here and pick the second point next point and next point and press scroll model button to place the dimension similarly we're going to take total dimension so pick first point here and pick the next point and press the scroll model button to place the dimension right click mouse interrupt now press click on it dimension drag and place the position properly now select this base plate right click on mouse add mark and apply now have base plate part mark hold the shift and left mouse key to adjust the position of this part mark and only use the left mouse key to adjust the position without moving arrow now I want to create a whole part mark so click on it right click on mouse add mark and apply hold the shift and left mouse key and the drag and place at here like this I want to create a section view for this base plate so click on this view and select this section view and pick the first point and pick the second point here and now we need to pick the cut box so pick the first point here and pick the second point to cover holes and base plate now you will get this symbol like this now use the left mouse key click on it to place the section view like this now click on this boundary and use the left mouse key to adjust the position like this now I'm going to get a dimension thickness so go to dimensioning and set this horizontal distance and pick the first point and second point press the scroll middle button to place the dimension right click mouse interrupt now I'm going to create base plate part mark so select it right click on mouse add mark and apply it like this select this arrow and use the left mouse key to adjust the position properly as you require like this now I have the bill of material for this single part drawing here now I have part mark and profile and grade quantity and length now use the shortcut control s for save the drawing now close window here 
okay that's it about how to create single part drawing for this base plate if you like this video please like it and share it if you have any doubts please comment below for more tech class structure related videos please go to my channel youtube.com slash gany sk i will provide this link in the description below of this video please go through it and come here under videos you can find out so many tech class structure related videos i hope these videos might be helpful to you and at the top right corner please click on subscribe button if you subscribe you will get notification or updates when uploading new video so please click on subscribe okay thank you